you guys, it's Sydney, and today I'm going to be doing a very quick, easy makeup tutorial for you. This is like my everyday, easy, back-to-school makeup look, and quick disclaimer, I just wanted to say that you guys don't need to feel like you have to wear makeup to school. I do it just because it makes me feel more comfortable and confident, and if that's what you want to do, you do it. If you want to wear, I don't know, like red lipstick and like a dark smoky eye or something, you could totally do that, or you, or you could just not wear anything at all. You guys can do whatever you want, whatever makes you feel beautiful and confident, and this is just what I do. It's quick and super easy. Um, what else? This video is longer or it seems like it takes longer than it actually does in the morning just because I'm talking to you guys and explaining everything. But this look really does not take much time. I could probably do it in under 10 minutes if I wanted to. And I think that's about it. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is use the Pixie by Petra Correction Concentrate. And I got this in a sample when I ordered some other stuff from there. And this is just like a brightening concentrate. And I'm just taking a little bit on my fingertip and then putting it right on my inner corner area, kind of under my eye bags, like that. I'm also gonna put some on my lid. If you have like veiny eyelids or anything, this will be good for you. Now for the next step, it is time for foundation slash like a base. And um, I am going to be using my L'Oreal Pro Matte because this keeps me matte all day and it is more of a full coverage foundation and I do have some discoloration, acne scars, and acne spots at the moment. So this is really good for me, but if you want a more light coverage or something like that, you can use the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB. This is super light and it doesn't have very good oil control, so if you have like dry to more normal skin, I would recommend this for you. And if you want like a medium coverage, I also really like the Garnier BB Cream. So I just took some of that L'Oreal foundation on the back of my hand and I'm going to blend that in using my Real Techniques complexion sponge. And I'm just focusing this more on like the center of my face because that's where I have my blemishes and stuff. Now to cover up any little spots, I'm going to use my L'Oreal True Match Concealer in the color N4-5. And to blend that in, I'm using my Target Complexion Brush. Now, especially since we're waking up super early for school, you, we are going to have pretty like dark circles. I'm not that bad. I don't really have a super dark circle problem, but I know so many people do, so I am going to use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. And when I bought this, I bought it in a shade too light by accident. Like, this is really light for me, but it still does the job. It's just like very highlighted. I'm just gonna put that under my eyes and blend it in with that sponge again. Now to set all that makeup I'm going to use my L'Oreal Infallible Setting Spray on that same Real Techniques sponge and I'm gonna take the flat side and kind of pack that in there and then put it under my eyes. You always want to set your under eye concealer even if you don't have oily skin. And I'm just going to kind of blend in, blend that in with my Real Techniques setting brush. Now to bring some life back into the skin, I'm going to use my Milani bronzer in um, the color number one, Bronze Glow. And this is my Target powder brush. I'm just going to swirl that around and put this all over like the perimeter of my face kind of. And since I'm not going to be using any blush, I'm just going to take a little bit of the exact same bronzer and just kind of put it where my blush would go, just to add some color to my cheeks. Now this part is completely optional, but I really like when my skin has a light glow, so I am going to use my Topshop highlighter, my cream highlighter in the color Gleam. And this is just, you can quickly tap this on, just like the high points of the cheeks and blend it in. It blends in super nicely. Super natural too, and it just takes a few seconds. You can kind of see that subtle glow, right? Now that we're completely done for the skin, it's time to go on to eyes. I want to keep it super simple, and I'm not going to do any eyeshadow or anything, so I'm just going to do some eyeliner, and I'm using the NYC Liquid Eyeliner, and I'm just going to do a quick thin line, like just a thin line on my eye, no wing. 
And now while I'm waiting for that eyeliner to dry, I'm going to do my brows. And I really don't do my brows, but if you want to fill them in, you could use a powder or a quick little pencil. I know the NYX brow pencil is pretty good. Um, I'm just going to use some clear mascara or clear brow gel and set these in place. And now I'm going to curl my eyelashes in prep for mascara. And today on the eyes, I'm going to be using my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. Now for lips, I'm going to use some Nivea Lip Balm. And this is just my typical daily lip balm. I like it a lot and it smells good. And now, for to add just a little bit of life and color, I'm going to use so the ColourPop Lippy Stick Sheer in Juice Bar. And I'm going to pat this on my lips. And yeah, that's about it for the makeup. Okay, so that is it for my easy back to school makeup look. I hope you liked it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're feeling extra nice, please subscribe. I would really, really appreciate it. The last time I checked, I was at 900 subscribers, and sometimes like someone will unsubscribe, so it'll go down, so I don't wanna like say I'm at 900 subscribers yet. But thank you guys so, so much for subscribing. I really, really appreciate it, and it honestly just makes me super happy to know that people actually enjoy the content that I'm creating. And yeah, that's about it. I love you guys so, so much. Have a good time at school if you are in school. I'm starting really soon and I'm starting to like get really freaked out but I'm just gonna stop blabbering and leave you guys and yeah. Bye!